Some Chesapeake residents are concerned a school for children with behavioral issues may be closed. The school board is considering seven options for the aging building in Deep Creek. Some would move the students into other middle schools. Ten your side's Jason Marks is at tonight's public hearing as parents voiced their concerns. Jason? Stephanie, there were a lot of speakers tonight. This is really a passionate issue. The school board has decided something needs to be done. What to do, though, is up for debate. The Chesapeake School Board meeting was a bit more colorful than normal. Parents have asked for a long-term solution for CSEP, and they deserve it. The green and purple, a showing of both school pride and serving as a message that in this case, change is not good. C-STEP students also deserve a decent place to learn, but not at the expense or safety of any middle school child. The topic of conversation is what to do with the city's CSEP program. The problem stems over this aging building on George Washington Highway. It's home to more than 100 special needs and behavioral problem students. I am in favor of options one, five, and six, promoting a standalone off-site facility. The school board is mulling over seven potential options. They include anywhere from just fixing the old building to moving the CSEP students into Deep Creek, Greenbrier, and Indian River Middle Schools. Parents say that's a safety concern. If you place the CSEP program in any of the existing middle schools, it is not a question of if something will go wrong, but a question of when something will go wrong. There is a lot for the school board and parents to debate, but they all agree something needs to be done. We know money is tight, but something needs to be found to provide a freestanding regional CSEP program for these 108 to 150 students. Ladies and gentlemen of the board, I implore you to do what is right and what is good. Fight for our students. Fight for the well-being and future of our children of Chesapeake. Most of the speakers tonight just want to see the CSEP students continue to have their own building, either by renovating the existing one or building a new one. Board members say either option will cost millions. The board is scheduled to make a decision next month. You can read all seven options for yourself at wavy.com. In the newsroom, Jason Marks, 10 on your side.